Vale, pues le damos eh, Stanley Parable, eh, Ultra Deluxe Episodio 2 eh, eh, Le estoy poniendo la hora y me está diciendo cosas Así que a ver qué me dice Es por configurar la hora las dos veces que ya esté el juego Mucha gente no se toma en serio este paso Dejan de reloj a las 12 y siguen adelante Pero tú tomaste el tiempo para configurarlo Y te lo agradezco Ahora sé que esta experiencia es importante para ti, estás prestando atención Ni siquiera tengo forma de saber si la hora que pusiste es la correcta ¿Sabes algo? Hagamos un trato como cooperaste a la próxima vez que inicies el juego y veas esta pantalla, pon tu hora favorita en el reloj. Hostia, las 7 y 20. Adelante, elige la hora que quieras, aunque no sea correcta, te lo ganaste. Y en día te dejo de vuelas al videojuego. ¡Qué genios! ¡Qué manera de empezar tú! ¡Qué flipante! ¡Me encanta! ¡Vamos para allá! A ver. Lo primero, tengo que abrir mi paint. Aunque yo lo llame. Vamos a dejar la historia mientras busco. Mientras abro mi paint. Stanley worked for a company in a big building where he was employee number 427. Employee ¿Dónde está? number 427's job was simple. Aquí. He no. sat at his desk in Aquí. room 427 and he pushed buttons on a keyboard. Orders came to him through a monitor on his desk, telling him what buttons to push, how long to push them, and in what order. This is what employee 427 did every day of every month of every year. And although others might have considered it soul ripping, Stanley relished every ahí está el pain. Oh, 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 ahí. Man, as though he had been made exactly for this job. And Stanley was happy. ¡Ole! Vamos a ver qué acaba este juego. And then one day something very peculiar happened. Something that would forever change Stanley. Something he would never quite forget. He had been at his desk for nearly an hour when he realized that not one single order had arrived on the monitor for him to follow. Oh, oh. No one had showed up to give him instructions, call a meeting, or even say hi. Never in all his years at the company had this happened, this complete isolation. Something was very clearly wrong. Shocked, frozen solid, Stanley found himself unable to move for the longest time. But as he came to his wits and regained his senses, he got up from his desk and stepped out of his office. Hola de nuevo, lo he desbloqueado por volver a venir. Vale, a ver, el paint. Vamos a ver antes de nada. Eh, tenemos todos estos finales. Nos falta puerta derecha. Vale, no contenido, no. Puerta derecha. Y eh, ascensor hacia abajo. Vale. Vamos a hacer eso. Ah, y aún hay que buscar el ordenador con... Con input. Aún falta un ordenador que tiene un input que no, que no he visto. ¿Qué ordenadores me quedan? Tampoco me quedan tantos ordenadores sin ver. Ahí está el nuevo contenido. Guiaremos. Uy, espera. Tengo que poner esto, si no, no veo el chat. No. This was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Ah, yes, truly a room worth admiring. It had really been worth the detour after all. Se, se, se ha reiniciado, ¿no? No Stanley es. Took the first open door on his left. No sé por aquí ahora. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door and got back on track. Vale, este es el ascensor que bajaremos. Vale, quiero ver ordenadores. Quiero ver si ah, me he cerrado. Quiero ver si hay alguno está en la puerta izquierda. Quiero ver si hay algún ordenador. Que tenga el input. Yet there was not a single person here either. No. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Hope coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. No. Esto no estaba abierto. Stepping into his manager's office, ah, was la primera tiene que ser la buena. Indication of any human life. Shocked, unraveled, Stanley wondered in disbelief who orchestrated this. 
What dark secret was being held from him? What he could not. Me. All of his co workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply. Vamos a hacer lo de bajar hacia abajo por el ascensor directamente. Claro es que el nuevo contenido está ahí. When Stanley came to a set of two open doors, this was not the correct way to the meeting room, and Stanley knew it perfectly well. Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge first, just to admire it. Wow. Yes. This room. Tengo que. But eager to get back to business. Ahora iniciado, ¿no? El juego no recuerda lo de la la vez anterior. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door, and got back on track. Ojo. Oh. But Stanley didn't want to go back to the office. He wanted to wander about and get even further off track. So now, in order to get back, he needed to go um uh from here. It's um left. Hmm. Que mira que bien. Oh no, no, it's to the right. My mistake. Qué hijo de puta. No, 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 not the right. Why would I have ever said it was to the right? What was I thinking? <laughs> it's clearly. Oh dear, would you hold on for a minute, please? Now let's see. We went down, right, left, down, left, right. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yes, I've got it now. <laughs> this story is absolutely, definitely this way. Qué miedo. No, 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 no. This isn't right at all. You're not supposed to be here yet. This is all a spoiler. Stanley, close your eyes. Okay, 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 okay. We just, we just have to get back to um. Spoiler. Who am I kidding? It's all rubbish now. The whole story completely unusable. How about rather than waste my time trying to salvage this nonsense, we'll just restart the game from the beginning. And this time, suppose we don't wander so far off track, hmm? Okay, from the top. Ooh. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Ooh. Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Puedo volver al mismo sitio? En plan, se lo estoy jodiendo a posta. No veo ningún ordenador con que me pida un input. Oh, ahora vuelve a ser la 416. Oh, vale, sí, estamos en No, no I Stanley, did you change anything when we were back in that room with all the monitors? Did you no. move the story somewhere or a... Hold on. Why am I asking you? I'm the one who wrote the story. It was right here just a minute ago. I know for sure that it's here somewhere. Okay then. It's an adventure. Oh, Come, Stanley. Let's find the story. Vale, un, dos, tres, cuatro. Cuatro puertas. Vale. Eh, ascensor Hostia, voy a necesitar Un gran hueco Vale, voy a borrar aquí Un momento, eh Ascensor Esto viene por aquí Esta línea menos gruesa Esto viene por aquí Esto viene por aquí Ahí, y ahí cuatro I'll say it. This is the worst adventure I've ever been on. I can promise you there definitely was a story here before. <laughs> do we just do we need to restart the game again? No, 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 no. Well, I find it unlikely that we'll ever progress by starting over and over again, but it's got to be better than this. Okay, let's give it a shot. Why not? Oh! Final de quedarse quieto. All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Ah, sí que estaba con decidido, sigue siendo una aliada. 
Ahí ya no hay ninguno. Okay, yep, it's worse. <risa> I might be remembering this wrong. It's possible the story is back where we just came from. Why don't we go back the other direction and see if we missed anything? No había que darle con un montón de golpes a esta. No, pero eso era para lo del logro. Hombre, ahora que está aquí la 416. No, no hay input que valga. Ajá. I knew we'd miss something. Esto es nuevo. The story. Here it comes. No, wait. Never mind. Not the story. Okay, let's head back the other way and retrace our steps. Oh fuck. Now this well I'll be honest, I don't recognize this place at all. Is this the story? I don't think so. I can't quite recall, but I believe my story took place in an office building. It is that correct? Hmm. Do you remember, Stanley? Well do you know what? Since I've completely forgotten what we were supposed to be doing, how about this? You win! Congratulations! <laughs> I know you put in a lot of hard work and it really paid off. So Good job. Oh no. No, I don't feel right about this at all. We both know you didn't put in any actual work for that win. Some people win fair and square, and this was not one of those situations. Okay? I'm getting weirded out by whatever this place is. I don't care what might happen this time, I have to restart. All right. I've got a solution. <laughs> This time, to make sure we don't get lost, I've employed the help of the Stanley Parable Adventure Line. Adventure line. Let's follow the line. How simple is that? <laughs> Ostias! No, no, I'm down. We're leaving it up to the line from now on. Ah, vale, vale. <laughs> La línea. Ay, no puedo pagar este ordenador. Llevo viendo todo el rato. Hostia. You see? The line knows where the story is. It's over in this direction. Onward, Stanley, to destiny. The... Here's a thought. Wouldn't wherever we end up be our destination, even if there's no story there? Or to put it another way, is the story of no destination still a story? Simply by the act of moving forward, are we implying a journey such that a destination is inevitably conjured into being via the very manifestation of the nature of life itself? Okay, Stanley, I need to follow this train of thought for a minute. Just stick with me. Now we can both agree that the nature of existence is in fact a byproduct of one subjective experience of that existence, right? Okay. Now oh, the experience of your existence rests inside of your subjective experience of this office. Is this office in fact the skeleton of my own relative experiential mental subjective construct? Whoa, 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 whoa. Hang on. That got a bit weird back there. Well, I'd like to apologize. Not sure where I was going with all that. You know what? I think what we need right now is a bit of music to lighten the mood. Dios! No pega nada. <laughs> Eh, hay dos. Peer reviews. Me he perdido, eh. Ah, hostia, vale. Pero, un momento. Esto no es igual a esto. O oh, sí, así. ¿What? Cut the music. 
Go back and look at that fern. Stanley, this fern will be very important later in the story. Make sure you study it closely and remember it carefully. You won't want to miss anything. He hecho una foto, vale, de hecho. Wait, what? We're back at the office? No, no, no. Line, you do know we're looking for the Stanley Parable, right? The story? Is any of this ringing a bell? ¿Me puedo meter dentro? No. Se ha abierto otra línea, ¿no? Está, está de aquí. Ah, o sea, está, ha cruzado. Esa, esas y otras están cruzadas. Hostia puta. Oh. Oh no, 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 not again, Line. How could you have done this to us? And after we trusted you, after everything we've been through, you. No, oh, I can't take this anymore. To hell with it. Restart. You know what, Stanley? I say forget the adventure. What's it ever done for us? We're intelligent people, right? Why can't we make up our own story? Something exciting, daring, mysterious. Oh, this all sounds perfectly doable. Why don't we simply start wandering in... Well, I don't know. How about this direction? Ah, vale. Now... Yes, this is exciting. Just me and Stanley forging a new path, a new story. Well, it could be anything. What do you want our story to be? Go wild. Use your imagination. Whatever it might be, Stanley, I'm ready for it. Oh, no, not you again. Stanley, I'd also like to veto the line from having any role in our awesome new story. No lines or monitor rooms. Just don't acknowledge it. We should be fine. ¿Quiere que dé la vuelta? Ah, ya no hay línea. Ah, a choice. We get to make a decision. From here, the story is in our control. How important we mustn't squander the opportunity. In fact, I believe I need a minute to think here. Just walk in circles for a minute. Okay, <laughs> so I know that each door has to lead somewhere, which means that somewhere at the place where we're trying to go, there must be a reverse door yeah, there is. here. And that in turn means that our destination corresponds with the counter-inverted reverse door's origin. So starting from the right, let us ask, will taking the right door lead us to where we're going? And since the answer is clearly yes, then by all accounts, the door on the right is the correct one. Another victory for logic. Claro, es de right. Stanley, <laughs> our destiny awaits. Ni siquiera me ha abierto la izquierda. Oh, hold up, what's this? Hostia! Hmm. The confusion ending. You're telling me that's what this is? It's all one giant end. Intenta inventar una historia aquí. En la dos inicia partida. Ya me oficiamos en España de nuevo. Vamos a los primeros de vida. Vete y vete. En la dos inicia partida. En la dos inicia después mucho tiempo está y muere. It's all determined. Dios. So now, according to the schedule, I restart again. Then what? Am I just supposed to forget? Well, what if I don't want to forget? My mind goes blank simply because it's written here on this this thing wall. Well, who consulted me? Why don't I get to decide? Why don't I get a say in all of this? Is it really? No, it can't be. I, I don't want it to be. I, I está el narrador, está condicionado. I, I don't want to forget what's going on. I don't want to be trapped like this. I won't restart the game. I won't do it. I won't do it. I won't do it. And the timer to stopped. Does that mean? Um, did we do it? Did we break the cycle? The um. Whatever it is that made this schedule, how would we even know? Will someone come for us? Will something happen? 
So, okay. I guess now we just wait. You know, I suppose in some way that this is a kind of story, wouldn't you agree? I'm not quite sure if we're in the destination or the journey. Though they're always saying that life is about the journey and not the destination. So I hope that's where we are right now. We'll find out, won't we? Eventually. Well, in the meantime, if you... Comme ça? Y ese pitido? All of his co-workers were gone. What could it mean? O sea, Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. Sí que ha habido un reinicio. Input? No. Eh! Ah, otra vez hay que hacerlo. Hostia. Vale. Vale, quiero buscar todas las estas del input. ¿Cuál es el final más fácil de pillar? Suicidarse, supongo. Y Stanley sabía perfectamente Perhaps he wanted to stop by the employee lounge Por cierto, first, eh, había cuatro puertas y yo es que me he quedado parado. Mm. Tendría que intentarlo otra vez al final de la línea. Sí, voy a intentar otra vez y si veo que se estanca en lo mismo, repito ya. Está. Me tiro ya está. Ah, no, no, no. Hay un algo, ¿eh? Te puedes, no puedes, no puedes llegar. Ah, espera. ¿Esto no te puedes subir a las sillas? ¿Y si hago esto a la vuelta? Ahí parece haber un agujero, ¿verdad? ¡Hostia, la línea de la historia! Está ahí. Es la línea de la historia. Ahí parece haber una... Esto parece una puerta. ¡Ojo! ¡Ojo! Otro final. Stanley had not gotten himself so far off the beaten path that it seemed the office had begun from so far off the beaten path that it seemed the office had begun from so far off the beaten path that it seemed the office had begun from so far off the beaten path that it seemed the office had begun from so far off the beaten path that it seemed the office had begun from so far off the beaten path that it seemed the office had begun from so far off the beaten path narrador dialogue you didn't think i was actually just a recording did you what a silly and trite explanation that would be all the back and forth between you and me all the absurd adventures we've been through and it all turns out i'm just a tape recording it was all just in stanley's head I bet that's the kind of twist you think is revelatory. I bet each and every time you watch a movie where it turns out all to be in the main character's imagination, you must absolutely bolt off the couch in pure shock at the phenomenal and intricate storytelling. It must be so simple to be you. Se nota que un poco más vieja esta voz. Ending waterfall of surprises and delights. How much more exciting you must find the world than the rest of us do. <sighs> Now I've become sad. Look what you've done to me. This is all your fault. <risa> vale. Eh, tenemos nuevo final. Vas a ver el pain. Tenemos nuevo final. Este es nuevo final. Eh, a ver, lo primero. Aquí he hecho una que es esperar, pero no sé si, si todas van a hacer lo mismo. Esperar nos lleva al final de la confusión. Pero supongo que a lo mejor todas llevan al mismo. Hagas lo que hagas. ¡Hostia! Vale, perdón. De los títulos de las partidas. Eh, ¿Cuánto es? ¿20? Ni siquiera. Eh, espera, es que hay que ponerlo en... Times New Roman. ¡Uh, qué va! Esto es un 8, así. Sí, confusión. Eh, y a confusión se llega mediante... O sea, un 10. Confusión se llega mediante... Quieto. Me he quedado quieto sin querer, eh. Vale, entonces vamos a ir buscando la movida esta primero. Esto aquí, esto aquí. ¿Qué leches pasa? Es otro narrador ha puesto la voz. Ah, no, claro. Eh, el narrador jugó después. O sea, me jugó después. Esta es la versión extra de Lux tiene contra round de nuevo el mismo tío. Entonces tiene la voz un poco más vieja. 
Se nota, ¿eh? El juego tiene un montón de años. Entonces, el narrador es el mismo, pero tiene la voz un poquito más cascada. ¡Eh! Ahí está. Segundo input. Vale. Hay que encontrar cinco. Estaban, estaban en el mismo sitio, o sea que todos los inputs estaban en el mismo sitio. Estaba volviendo a clase ahora, puta Emma. Vale, vamos a hacer... El mismo final. El de. Ah, y espera, ya había encontrado otro final. Que es en vez de. ¿Dónde está el de saltar del monta Aquí, suicidio. Aquí al lado hay otro. Que es. Eh, grabadora. Vale, esto no, no lo estás viendo. Ahora lo, lo, lo mostráis. Hace falta. Grabadora. Perfecto. Final de la grabadora. ¿Ya se entra a la puerta New Content? Yo diría que no. No, aún no he entrado. Es que aún hay cosas del, del Old Content por hacer. Entonces, aún no he entrado. Standing now in this incredible room, Stanley for the first but eager to get back to business. Stanley took the first eh, vale, ascensor y vamos a ver si por alguna de las cuatro puertas pasa algo. Ahora entro, ya no me quedan más finales, creo. Lo tengo todo ya ubicado. But Stanley didn't want to go back to the office. He wanted to wander about and get even further off track. So now in order to get back, he Ahora me abría a la izquierda y a la derecha. Puedo entrar, a lo mejor, si estoy ya dándole. From here it's um Oh no, no it's ah, the vale, right mistake. Cabrón. No, 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 not the right. Why would I have ever said it was to the right? What was I thinking? It's clearly Oh dear, would you hold on for a minute, please? Ahora, ahora vamos al, al new content. Ahí quiero hacer el input. Pero no sé qué ordenadores me quedan. A ver, hostia, las versiones infantiles de Otesanek. ¡Hostia! ¡Qué guapo! Las versiones de Otesanek de los chavales. <risas> Creo que vas a esperar de nuevo. No, 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 pero no se espera aquí, se espera en la siguiente, en la siguiente. Ahora reiniciamos. Ahora reiniciamos. Y ha cambiado la movida. Ahora ya no hay inputs. Porque estamos en el, en el final de este. Te crees que es el mismo, pero no es el mismo. Porque está esta puerta cerrada ahora. Y aquí ya no está esto. O sea, hay cuatro puertas. No, I restarted. I swear, I definitely restarted the game over completely fresh. No, sí, por la primera Everything izquierda. Be... Oh, did something change? Stanley, did you change anything when we were back in that room with all the monitors? Did you move the story somewhere or... Uh... Hold on. Why am I asking you? I'm the one who wrote the story. It was right here just a minute ago. I know for sure that it's here somewhere. Okay, then. It's an adventure. Back. Come, Stanley. Let's find the story. Ah, va a ser toda la misma mierda, ¿no? Ah, 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 vale, es un círculo. Vale, o sea, esperar no es esperar. Superliminal es de los mismos, creo que no. Superliminal, creo que no. Eh, The Beginner's Guide seguro, pero Super Liminal creo que no. O sí, no lo sé. Son buenos haciendo. Vale, vale, es, es, lo mis, es lo mismo, es lo mismo, es lo mismo. Vale, pues ya solo queda. Bueno, o encontrar el input o new content. A ver si el input sale en algún lado. Entiendo que reiniciar servirá, ¿no? Para que esto cambie de sitio. 
Pa, pa, pa. Aún no, todavía no. Vamos a entrar, lo prometo, pero aún no. ¿Dónde hay más ordenadores? ordenadores aquí. Stanley took the first open door on his left. No has visto el ordenador de abajo. He toured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door and got back on track. Aquí no hay ninguno. There was not a single person here. Queda la secretaria. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided to go up to his boss's office. Si no está en la secretaria, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. Queda este, ¿no? Ah, míralo. ¡Hostia! Fíjate. Vale, pues me quedan dos inputs. All of his coworkers were gone. What could it mean? Stanley decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. No, no. No. Oye, no. No. Uy. ¿Esto ha cambiado? ¡Ojo! ¡Ojo, esta es nueva! ¿Ese pasillo era distinto? Eh... ¿Qué ordenador queda? Ah, queda el ordenador de Stanley. No hemos visto el ordenador de Stanley, a lo mejor era ese. The lounge was grand, majestic. Perhaps too but eager to get back to business, Stanley took the first open door on his left. Mm. And so he detoured through the maintenance section, walked straight ahead to the opposite door and got back on track. Yet there was not a single person here either. Feeling a wave of disbelief, Stanley decided Stanley stepped into the broom closet, but there was nothing here. So he turned around. Coming to a staircase, Stanley walked upstairs to his boss's office. De aquí no hay ningún ordenador. ¿Hiciste abrir la puerta? No, aún no. Ah, pues no. Eh, aquí hay algún ordenador. Esto está cerrado ya. Ah, pues no. Sí, pero eso no tenía nada. A lo mejor como se ha hecho esta zona chunga Se ha comido una... Ah, mierda, espera, espera, espera A ver el mío Ah, pues no Qué miedo, eh, lo de alguien está siguiendo a Stanley Eh, ah, está aquí Me lo he dejado, vale ¿Y ahora? Ah, mira Bienvenido al... Bienvenido a Stanley al cielo. Son botones. ¿Ese es el cielo? ¿Pulsar botones? ¿Hay que apagarlo todo? Esto me está haciendo daño a los ojos. Jodas, ¿hay que apagarlo todo? ¿De verdad? Estaba esperando a que pasara algo No me jodas Te acuerdas cuatro horas de ver Así que sería posible ¡No! ¿Qué se oye? Buttons ¿No? Es lo que quiero oír se están volviendo a encender. ¡Se están volviendo a encender! ¡Mira! ¡Que es una aliada! ¡Que se vuelven a encender! ¡Que no puedo! ¡Que no se puede! <ríe> ¡Que se vuelven a encender! 
Pues con internet, no, hombre, espérate, a ver si haciendo una línea entera a lo mejor. A lo mejor una línea sí que puedo. No, se está iluminando ya. Es súper rápido, es rapidísimo. ¿Hay algún botón que sea distinto? Naranja, ocre, morado, azul, rojo. No hay nada más. Es... Ah, me pareció ver un dorado, me estoy volviendo loco. Son todos iguales, no hay ninguno distinto. Esto es un infierno. ¿Hay alguno, hay algún patrón o algo? Estos parecen distintos. No son distintos. <risa> Ay, por favor Esos tres <risa> Vale, a ver Heaven Ending <risa> you can only exit this ending by resetting the game on your own <risa> Vale, no hay nada Hay que, hay que volver <risa> No, no hay final <risa> Este es el final Ay, la madre que me parió Que es que no se puede Vale, ah, hostia, vale Pues mira, se queda eso ahí para siempre <risa> Final de los botones Ole, vamos a ver mi paint eh, vale, esto entonces no es nada Esto no existe Esto es fuera Esto lo voy a dejar así Pero bueno, queda feísimo Y... Eh, 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 espera, en la oficina Botones O sea, botones eh, Se entiende que Geaven Vale pues ya digo que de aquí no me queda nada más Me queda el nuevo contenido Esto todo tiene un final Esto se puede ir fuera De hecho realmente Esto se puede ir fuera De hecho realmente Esto se puede ir fuera Y acortamos a esto Así Vale, pues ahora sí Ha llegado el momento eh... Nuevo contenido que este... Ah, pero ya no puedo, claro. No puedo porque está hasta aquí. Vale, va, no contenido. Vale, va, no contenido. Vale, va, no contenido. Vale, no contenido. Sí podías. Ah, vale. Pues es que antes no se podía. Bueno, tú estabas cuando lo vimos. Lo han cambiado, lo han arreglado, a lo mejor. Hello, and thank you for playing the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. <risa> As you may know, the Stanley Parable was a video game released in 2013 on home computers. After receiving critical and commercial success, it was expanded upon in 2022 with the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. A reimagining of the game for consoles and home computers. The Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe Content. features exciting new content that broadens and expands the world of the Stanley Parable, delighting audiences the world over. Qué turbio. Please step inside and see what thrilling new adventures await in the Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe. Oh well, this sounds delightful. I'm very excited to see the thrilling new Ultra Deluxe content. Okay, so far it's an elevator. Nothing special yet, but I'm sure it's just the beginning of a mesmerizing adventure. Um, is it broken? What's going on here? 
Should we... Should we be moving somewhere or... or oh, there we go. All right, finally, <laughs> at long last, it's on to the new content. I've never been more ready. Let's do it. Me espero lo peor, eh? <laughs> hmm. Hmm. I have to say, initial impressions of Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe, mostly tedious. It's oh. as if... Um, oh, okay. Let's see the content. Give me the content, Stanley. All right. All right, let's see. It's the jump circle. Is... is that it? Surely that's not all the new content. There has to be something else, right? Ni siquiera está conectado a nada. Ya queréis, eso a la mesa. No hay carrilla de valga, de hecho te frena. No puedes. Me quedan nueve saltos. <risa> Hay que joderse. <risa> La gente pidió que se pudiera saltar en el juego. Initial impressions of this game are not positive. It's just elevators and jumping. Is this what passes for exciting new content? If this is new content, then I could just read you the whole dictionary. There's 20 hours of new content right there. Hell, I could count to 30 trillion. You could put that on the box. The Stanley Parable Ultra Deluxe, now with over a thousand hours of new content. And if... Oh, wait. There's more. Very good. Yes. I knew there had to be something else. Let's see it. I'm ready for whatever it is. No me quedan saltos. A lo mejor si guardas saltos... <laughs> That's it? Oh, you've got to be kidding me. You see, Stanley? This is what happens when greedy video game developers with no respect for their fan base <laughs> rush a cheap expansion to market for no reason... Ojalá fuera de verdad. Todo es, esto es and todo. And don't get me started on the level of craftsmanship that's gone into it. In fact, I'm looking right now at the game's achievements and it's hard to believe one of them actually says test achievement, please ignore. <laughs> what quality assurance department signed up on this? I'm infuriated and I'm offended and I I intend to find these people on Twitter and hold them personally accountable. <sighs> it's my fault, Stanley. I built up too much anticipation around the new content, I'm afraid. It could never have lived up to such expectations. If you're still with me, why don't we just reset the game and we'll try to get back to what the Stanley parable is really about. No frills, no gimmicks. Just you and me having a great time together like always. What do you say, friend? Oh, fuck. Es como, es como que han alejado la vista, ¿no? O sea, es como, como que la han alejado. Psst. Stanley. Come over here, in the vent. I want to show you something. Be vale. Pero hay una puerta ahí. No hacerle caso al narrador es bueno. Eso es lo que nos han enseñado. Hostia. Eh, vale, de momento no vamos a apañar nada. O sea, el pain lo vamos a dejar de momento. Okay, you remember how cheap and unsatisfying the new ultra deluxe content turned out to be? Well, it got me thinking about the past and how much better the Stanley Parable used to be. So I made something special and tucked it away here where the game's developers won't find it. Just our little secret. Take a look. 
I call it the memory zone. It's where I've been storing all my favorite memories so I can relive the peak experiences of my life whenever I want. Experiences like the launch of the Stanley Parable on PC. <laughs> you see, Stanley, doesn't the memory zone remind you of how wonderful Stanley Parable was before it was sullied with a cheap re-release? Remember back in October of 2013, when the game originally launched? Back then, video games had integrity. <laughs> Back then, it all meant something. Oh, the waste. Que pone de las tofas. De las tofas y le han puesto una pegatina. Oh no. Good times on photos. Oh, Dios, no. Mozilla Fire, ¿qué es esto? Ah, el... Hostia, chaval. 2013, está ni para ahora. Oh, Dios, no puedo. El primer dólar ganado con Stanley Parable, ¿no? Hostia, chaval. Demonstration. Oh, el logro imposible de conseguir. El, el logro de los 5 años, tú. Ahora hay uno de 10 años que quiero conseguirlo. Me, me, cuando termine este juego me pone una alarma. Una alarma, una notificación, un correo electrónico a mí mismo para dentro de 10 años para jugar a Stanley Parable. Diez años, eh. <ríe> Creer tu sorpresa y down on tu ver. Rages Ghost and Scandal to New Crisis. ¿Cuál es su? Oh, madre mía. Ay, no puedo salir. Hostia, hay un puto piano ahí. And over here is where I keep reviews of the Stanley Parable. Like this stunning triumph of games journalism. 10 out of 10 from Destructoid.com. No, don't do it. Stephanie Sterling writes, and I quote, Where so many games that aspire to be more than games end up less than any form of art, Stanley Parable strives and then succeeds to be every game ever created. Did you hear that, Stanley? Every game ever created. That's how grand and all-encompassing the original Stanley Parable was. It was literally every game ever created. It was Skyrim, it was Persona 3, it was all of them, and now it's nothing. It's no games at all. It isn't even the Stanley Parable anymore. It's just a husk now. A lifeless husk with an hour of new elevator content. Hostia, el portal. Es que hace aquí el portal. ¿El portal? ¿Minecraft? Ah, eran esos los juegos a los que te mandaba antes. Antes de que fuera el Rocket League y el otro. Persona de ayer. Hostia, las dos, las dos únicas figuritas que hay: Stanley y la chica que cuando te suicidas. Por Scott K. ¿Esta edición es, re es real? ¿Se sacó esta, esta edición? ¿Física? Hostia, qué raro, ¿no? La puerta roja y azul. Your number is 29. Ese, eso no lo he visto. Here's another moving passage. This time from GameSpot.com. <laughs> 
The Stanley Parable is both a richly stimulating commentary on the nature of <laughs> the son... games and one that offers some of the most interesting the and rewarding choices no I've ever that. been it's confronted it. with in a game. Nine out of ten. Don't you get it, Stanley? The game was perfect. It didn't need anything else. It didn't need new content. It just needed to be left alone. To spend the rest of time collecting dust in the hallowed hall of beloved video game memories. Caroline likes to venture of the beaten path in life as well as in games. As for the writer in her head is an early as right as the one in Stanley Parable. <laughs> Son reviews de verdad, entiendo. Oh, these were simpler times, Stanley. But I wouldn't give to go back to have it all over again. Wait. Hang on. I don't recall this part of the memory zone before. What's this? What's down here? Las oh, malas. No. Oh, God, no. Las Stanley, malas críticas. The of reviews from Steam, no! the online video game distributor. I haven't looked at these in years. No. I can't even imagine what's been collecting down here. Surely these reviews were glowing as well, weren't they? Oh, Dios. No. Oh, no. Honestly, I could not be bothered to play this game to full completion. The narrator is obnoxious and unfunny, with his humor and dialogue <laughs> proving to be more irritating than entertaining. Unfunny! I'm not trying to be funny. I'm trying to make a serious work of art. I suppose I could write up a handful of gags to insert into the Stanley Parable, but the game is already such a densely layered web of profound philosophical Hostia, insights, mundo abierto, eh, I can't even imagine where I'd have the room to stick them. Qué texturas más horribles, eh. Pero bueno, no ni se molestan en, en meterle una textura decente a este juego, ya ves para qué. Hostia. And funny. Me gustó mucho eso. Hostia, mala review esto. Ok, let's see what this one says. While the idea for the game is good, no, 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 for someone who prefers non-linear games, this preachiness gets annoying. Oh, oh, oh. Preachy? Stanley, I'm not preachy, am I? You can tell me if I'm preachy. Honestly, you can. <laughs> Goodness, this is actually quite shocking for me. I, I always, well, to be honest, I had always thought of the game's dialogue as being rather terse to begin with. You can't know how much fluff I cut from the game to get it to feel as light and airy as it, well, I always thought it did. But maybe it wasn't. Dear, what an awful memory to have to hold on to. These black marks are my otherwise unimpeachable track record. I feel like a failure. No. Like I let these people down. Perhaps the Stanley Parable isn't quite as sterling as I always no. remember. No. Pero hay un montón de buenas críticas. Oh, Dios. Esto lo va a hundir, eh? What's this one got to say? Do, 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 do. You constantly have to stop doing anything so the narrator can catch up with his long-winded explanations of what's happening. I wish there was a skip button. A skip button? Well, well, yes. Yes, I think we can do that. If I'm truly too preachy, then, then maybe letting you skip ahead for just a moment, surely it couldn't hurt. Not if it means we can strike these negative reviews from the record. Only positive reviews of the Stanley Parable. That's my motto today, and it's always been my motto. I'd do anything for the customer, Stanley. Yes, a skip button we shall have. <laughs> and here it is. Go ahead and give it a shot. I'll pop you forward in time so that the second my incessant droning starts to bore you with just the push of a button, you'll have zipped right past it. It's what the players have been asking for, and I'm very proud to have delivered. No more listening to me rambling on and on and on. Oh, yeah. no, no, no. The Stanley Parable is a game for the people, and if the people want silence, then by goodness, that's what they're going to get. Well, don't sit around waiting for me to shut up. Go ahead and make me shut up. Here. We'll pretend that I've just begun an interminable monologue, and it goes something like this. 
the story and the choices, or what have you, and therefore, by becoming it is, so on and so forth, until inevitably, we all until the end of time, at which time, everything all at once, so, now you see, blah, 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 I happen to believe it was perhaps one of my more profound such ruminations. Not that, of course, you need a description of it, but if I had to describe it, I'd say it was perhaps less of a rumination and more of a treatise. <laughs> well there, sport. You really did catch me rambling on a bit, didn't you? But that's the power of the button. The minute I start to go off on a thoughtless display of self-absorption, it's right... Okay, welcome back, Stanley. Now, I should say that the amount of time the button has been skipping hey, is becoming longer and longer. That last one was, well, I want to say maybe 30, 40 Déjale terminar. Es que no termina. Stanley, 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 please don't push the button again. It's been 12 hours. Wow. You've just been frozen there. I don't know why the skips are getting longer, but they're really, truly getting longer. And my God, there's no way out of the room. Stanley, the door is gone. It's completely gone. I've looked at it from every angle. I've checked every one of those walls a thousand times. And there's no door, Stanley. There's no door. There's just you and the button. And if you keep pressing it, I have no idea what will happen. I have no idea how long I'll be made to sit here. And more tiento. than anything else, I don't know how to stop you from pressing the button again. I can't control anything in this room, Stanley. I can't touch it. And I have to believe, I have to know that sooner or later, no matter how much I plead with you, you're going to press the button again. <laughs> Why would you? I've been thinking and thinking, and I, I don't know what I can do to convince you otherwise. Oh, my God. And it's all because of those reviews. Those reviews that I couldn't get out of my head. I just couldn't ignore the negative feedback. Why was it so important for me to fix the problem? Why did Cookie Nine's opinion matter so much to me? I've never even met Cookie Nine. I have no <laughs> idea who they are. What would it ever really matter? But here I am. I'm fixating on every tiny negative thing that anyone ever says about me. The merest mention of one of my imperfections, and I become as impetulant as a child. Wild and impulsive. I can't help myself. I can't stop myself from lashing out with a vengeful fury to alter and to change and to break any... Oh, Stanley, you're back. You're back. Oh, my goodness. I have someone to talk to again. Stanley, I... I think it's been a week. Or two weeks? I've been sitting here all that time. Just sitting here. Que tortura. A person to speak with. And you'd think that that's just how it's always been, right? Me talking and you saying nothing. Would you think that it's exactly the same as always? Doesn't that feel like what we've already been doing? Me just talking? But it isn't, Stanley. It isn't the same at all. It isn't even close. Because I know you can't hear me once you push that button. That's what I'm realizing now, Stanley. I'm realizing that I needed to know that someone was listening. I needed there to be a vessel through which my words were moving. It was the vessel I needed, Stanley. Not the outcomes, not the story. None of that matters anymore. I'll give it all up. I'll give up every branching path. I'll burn my story to the ground. One single thing I need, and God, I can see now that I need it more than anything, is to know that someone else is taking it in. These words that I'm saying, I need to know you can hear me. Because maybe, Stanley, maybe... Oh, hello. It's you. You're here again. Welcome. 
I have had time to think about you and about us and about everything we've been through. I've had so much time. I stopped keeping track after a year. Have you ever sat down in one place and not moved for one entire year? Se volvería loco, tío. Let me describe it for you. To begin with, there is only regret. There is only the turning wheel of missed opportunities. I felt nothing at all but regret for the longest time, Stanley. Days, months. I lost it all in a blur of the deepest longing to undo the past. ¿Cuánto le han pagado a este pavo por hablar? What took its place is what I can only describe as the collapse of every moment I have ever experienced my entire life. All of them collapsed down into a single instant. In that instant, I could see myself clearly, calmly, with a collected heart. Si este es un año sin el único actor que han pagado. Si el presupuesto puede ser bueno, sí, sí. I could do nothing but es que imagínate like que te entregan este guión y te dicen tira para allá. You see, it was a revelation for me. It was unlike anything I had ever known. It was a space without consequence, without action or outcome. It was divorced entirely from the question of free will that you and I have squabbled over for so long. There could be no one ending, no singular outcome of events, not if all events existed in the same moment. No quiero verlo. I felt unburdened by the need to manifest a particular outcome into being. No quiero hacerlo. Pero no se va a callar. And that each of them was simply Pero me da pena. In the web He estado un año being. sin hablar con nadie. Incredible. The spaciousness, the equanimity, the <laughs> Qué dolor. Ha estado un año sin hablar con nadie y yo no puedo aguantarle tres minutos. For the longest time, this was my experience. And then, this moment passed. And the most unyielding fear Hostia. I have ever known crept into my mind. And it is this sensation that I have been experiencing now for longer than I could have ever expected was possible. I have been waiting for you. Oh. Not that you might save me or do something to fix it, but merely to state for you the plain fact of this manner of existence. I wish you to feel afraid as I do. Oh, that Dios. perhaps one day this state of mind will consume you as well. Perhaps you will somehow, in some way, have to live as I do now. And I wish for you to know how excruciating it is, and for you to be in true terror of its eventual arrival. If I can only do this, only this one Venganza, thing, eh? perhaps it will bring me the smallest moment of peace in the darkness. A ver, si pasas tanto tiempo sin estímulos, eventualmente dejas de pensar. Es como Cars. Cars, el, no la película de los coches, coño, el, el de yoyos. Se ha jodido el aire acondicionado. Él ya no está, ¿eh? They didn't understand the game was never meant to be funny. It was meant to have a point. It was meant to speak to the human condition. But where are the jokes? Where are the jokes? They bemoaned. They screamed. They gnashed their teeth and said, entertain us. 
it wasn't enough. They had to leave a pathetic little thumbs down review and make all of their pitiful demands. But ¿Cuántos años ha estado pensando en las reviews negativas? It's the inconsistency, it's the lack of accountability, it's the unwillingness to examine with an uncompromising heart the words that they are speaking into the world. As though there were no consequences for a lack of cohesion in one's assessment of others. But of course, absolutely anyone can be believed. Sí, sí, so here's what we get. We get these demands that seek everything and are accountable to nothing. We get a world where someone will say, oh, there should be a skip button. You should be able to freeze Stanley in place while the narrator sits there forever and ever. We want all of this in the new Stanley parable. We demand it. And then, because it was said, because it was spoken, now it simply has to happen. The most immediate no tengo más que la mano, es every bueno, single thing Excel. demanded by every person at every moment Cojo in time. Excel. If someone eh, wants it, then it's a crime not to bring it into being. Un minuto, Have we been given to indulge in every minutos, whim for no, no sé. reason other than to do so? Yes! Yes! It seems that this is now the world we live in. It seems that we are a people living in such bleakness and discomfort with ourselves un that our entertainment is now our lives. It has come to represent us. It absolutely must speak o sea, el, to who we are as people. Because el siguiente habrán sido 50 y pico años. Y el siguiente, 50 por 50, 2000 y pico años. Y este habrá sido 2000 y pico por 52. Eso es general, 2000 y pico por 50. Bueno, no por no es exponencial. Eso sería si fuera progresiva. And so, so because of this, we require that our amusements and our playthings and our flights of fancy be so impossibly captivating that they consume all of our attention, turn our heads completely away from the bleakness. In effect, we have demanded that our entertainment be the collapse of ourselves. What a pitiful reflection of humanity these entertainments are. What a shameful mirror to the human spirit they project. I'm not mad. I'm not mad about any of this. I'm at peace with it. I am the calm center of gravity around which these perversions hurl themselves. I am a waypoint for reasonable and collected discourse. They're the ones who are mad. They're the ones who couldn't stand the idea of me using my game to try to say something. Maybe they were just jealous of me. Yes. Yes, of course. They've been jealous of me this whole time. They are mired in fear and insecurity and cannot help but attempt to tear me down. What a sad state of affairs. When you read these reviews now, you can see it. You can taste the bitter resentment. And my, how good does it feel now to speak truth to these words, to finally allow these thoughts out, contained and managed for so long, neutered and sterilized. At last I am free to truly think. To feel it must be that they were so discontent with themselves they couldn't help but leave a negative review on Steam. Perhaps it says far more about them than it ever said about me. Perhaps the state of their psychological. Han pasado demasiados años. No me gusta que no hable. Se está cayendo agüita. Han pasado demasiados años, eh. Demasiados. The end is never the end, 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 is never the end. Se ha vuelto loco. Esto no tendría que haber inundado este lugar, teniendo en cuenta que cada, cada clic son ya de donde sean miles de años. Jodido, eh. Si 
Se escapó el narrador. A lo mejor se fue. Espero que se fuera. ¡Hostia, chaval! El Portal 2, ¿eh? Oh. Un momento, estamos volviendo hacia atrás. Hostia, qué puto miedo, ¿no? Esto me ha dejado loco. Adiós al Coricha, porque te has dicho que te ibas. All of his coworkers were gone. What could it mean? Stan had decided to go to the meeting room. Perhaps he had simply missed a memo. No matter how hard Stanley looked, he couldn't find a trace of his coworkers. Levi, estoy viendo el paint. Ah, per perdón, perdón, lo siento. Se me pasa a veces. Ha sido como satisfactorio volver a oír su voz. Oye, ya está, ¿no? ¿O qué? ¿Qué más queda? New new content. <risa> oh, good. You noticed my sign. Yes, I have something very exciting to show you. New new content. <risa> Pero hay una puerta por la que no he ido. Esto ir para allá. No. Van a empezar los de umbral ahora. I've been reflecting on the Stanley parable and about how roundly disappointing this ultra deluxe version has turned out to be. La madre me parió. The original Stanley parable was a landmark and any new content for it should live up to that legacy. So forget this ultra deluxe nonsense. I say we take it one step even further. So, which is why I'm very proud to announce for the first time ever the Stanley Parable 2. Yes, you see, isn't this far superior to a measly re-release with a few minor additions? Think of all the new territory we'll cover with a fully-fledged sequel. An entirely new experience, built from the ground up. Why, there are so many possibilities. It could go in so many different directions. This is what fans have truly been asking for. La madre que me parió. Calling it the Stanley Parable 2 is just so much catchier than Ultra Deluxe, don't you think? Ultra Deluxe? What does it even mean? 
but the Stanley Parable too. Now that's an artistic statement right there. It's future-oriented. It screams progress and innovation and long-term franchising potential. La oficina es super nueva, tú. Cómo mola. They're back to doors. <laughs> Every pause button is a Roman numeral 2. <laughs> ¡Qué mierda! 1 plus 1 is 2 minus 1 is 1 plus 1 is 2 minus 1. 2 contento y 2 diferentes. Dos. Es, es como la oficina de ellos, ¿no? Morty SP, Verti SP, win win. <laughs> Sequential mindshare. 1, <laughs> 2. <Uno>, <laughs> Para Insist, Synergy, Bright, Mortal Approach, en modo que Sentry Marte de color red. Leverage Holistic Value. 1 a 2. <risa> TSP, logo, hay días. Esto es como súper genérico, ¿no? <risa> Ojalá fuera así su oficina de verdad. Que no creo, ¿no? Porque es como muy idílica. Hostia, esto es una locura, ¿eh? <risa> Now to be clear, I haven't quite nailed down what exactly the Stanley Parable 2 is the sequel. <laughs> but let's take a look at some of the features I've been developing for it. I figure that if I can loosely organize a <laughs> so that of might get me. <laughs> concepts, that surely the game will sort of naturally spring up around them. It'll all work itself out. Game development is much more of a fuzzy magic than anything scientific or logical, really. Esto es increíble. Que se burlen tanto de todo. Sequel Sar 2, Portal 2, Halley 2, Batman Arkham Asylum 2, City, Divinity Original Sin 2, Doom 2, Aladdin 2, Retorno Jafar, Dark Souls 2. ¡Dios! ¡Dios! ¡No puede ser! ¡Qué huevos! ¡Qué huevos! Ahí tiene la duda de esencia de broncas de umbral. Voy a verla. Voy, 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 voy. Voy. Hostia. Uh... Jolín. Y, y, y tiene mucho que ver con el juego este. Mierda. <risa> A ver. Ah, vale. No. ¡Guau! ¡Guau! ¡Ya lo tengo! Lee lo que voy a poner. Ve, Brick. <risa> Perfecto, Ari ha ido a preguntarme la mejor pregunta en el mejor momento, eh. Léelo, Brick, léelo. <risa> ella no ha jugado. Da igual, da igual, no necesita. No hace falta. Confío en ella. Ella puede. <risa> ella puede hacerlo. Si me, si me pregunta, avísame. Si me dice algo más. Hostia, chaval. New features. New content. El, el autobús del tren. Del hype. Qué locura esto, eh. Qué locura esto. Mira. Cómo ha cambiado el, el eco. Here we are. Go on. Try out some of the new features. Name here just today. Ah, pues ponle el nombre. Stanley para volto es clase. Botón de the name of the player that is playing the game. Here your name in the game. Hostia, hay una salida chunguilla, eh. For the Stanley Parable 2, I asked myself, what do players really want? 
And of course, the first and most obvious answer is that they want to be individually recognized and validated as people. So with that in mind, my first addition to the game is this button which speaks the name of the person playing the game. Isn't that wonderful? Stick it up. Va a decir Stanley o algo así. O un error. Jim. Sorry, I should have clarified. Right now, the button only says the name Jim. But of course, in the final game, this button will say your name, whatever name that is. Here, no let's puedo. have you role play as Jim to really simulate the full experience of this feature. Just play along. I promise you'll love it. Okay, here we go. Let's take a deep breath, clear your mind. Forget whoever you are and simply become a person named Jim. I want you to imagine yourself living as Jim, sleeping and waking as Jim, falling in love and being heartbroken as Jim, seizing all of the world's possibilities as Jim, and as Jim, watching your dreams crumble into dust. Do you feel it? Jim. Whoa, 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 hold on. I wasn't finished setting up the backstory. If you don't properly roleplay as Jim, then you'll never understand the impact of this button. <laughs> Otherwise, it's just a stupid button that says somebody else's name. <laughs> no okay, puede. we're doing it again. And no this puede time, ser. let me finish first. <clears throat> Now, allow yourself to become Jim. Imagine yourself driving to work as Jim, playing frisbee on the weekends as Jim. Staying up all night for a popcorn and horror movie sleepover as Jim. Developing a crippling substance addiction as Jim. Rediscovering yourself through fringe religious groups as Jim. Que? And finally, dying a slow death at an Hostia old age surrounded Jim. by members of your cult as Jim. Do you feel it in your soul? Are you really, truly Jim right now? Soy Jim. If so, then please step forward and press the button. Soy Jim. Jim. <laughs> yes, you see what a thrill, what a rush. That was you. The button described you. Do it again, do it again. Jim. Ooh, it hits even harder the second time. Oh, If this were the only new feature in the Stanley Parable 2, it would still be worth the money. Let's take a break from the Jim <laughs> button. I'm too emotionally drained from all of this personal validation. Jim. Oh, there, cowboy. Sometimes a person can be too much, Jim. I'm putting the gym button away. Otherwise, soon gym, you'll start to lose all gym, sense of who gym, you actually gym, are. Jim, 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 Ah! Quiero ser Jim! No! Bueno, haced lo que queráis. No puedo estar pendiente de lo que estáis diciendo. Le, le, dile, dile a Ari que... Bueno, haced lo que queráis. Yo, yo cogería mi idea. Pero bueno, yo cogería mi idea, claro, porque soy un egocéntrico de puta mierda. Yo qué sé. I suppose I could allow only people named Jim to play the Stanley Parable 2. That would actually save me the work of finishing this feature. No screenshots. A whole new office. No, please, no screenshots. Ah, vale, que no saques screenshots, vale. <laughs> Red Disney Dew Orange. The new update Ray Traced more the same, but in a good way. <ríe> Seco. Hostia, qué feo es el suelo, tú. No features, no he idea. Qué feo es el suelo. Consistent quality with just the right amount of change. The baby is all grown up. No, el bebé ha crecido. <ríe> Bancarrota. El bebé ha crecido. No. El botón dice no veo a pesar que está jugando. Círculo de salto, agujero infinito. Eh, vale. O sea, el botón. <risas> ah, dice Jim, ha cambiado. <risas> el botón que dice Jim. 
<risa> ha cambiado todo. No puede ser. No puede ser. Me estoy muriendo, ¿eh? Una última pregunta, Ari, que no recuerdo. Vale, voy. Ay. Pff. Es que... A ver, a ver, a ver. Es que... Jolín. Perdonad, es que no puedo... <risa> Lo siento, único espectador de Levi. Joder, eres tú. <risa> qué mierdas, yo qué sé. Pero es que no sé. Es que... Sí, pero... pero es que no sé. Eh... Yo, di yo diría que es buena idea hacer la movida esta que he dicho yo. Si no, simplemente pues, pues historia de... Como buena leco. Historia de... De Candy Candy, ya está. I said the new content. Está ahí para Bolchu. Pero sí, pues que si, si quiere hacer eso que hemos estado hablando, que lo haga. Tampoco. Yo es que pasa es que no tengo mucha idea. O sea, no sé. Es que no, no sé. Eh, yo diría la comparsa y acabamos rápido. Es que no sé. No sé. Que improvise, esto es un PBTA. Si el corazón le dice eso, eso, joder, qué español esto, ¿no? This t-shirt is the best new feature. <ríe> joder. Hay como varios caminos muy chungos. Balde tranquilizador de Stanley Parable. Decoraciones de oficina, agujero infinito. Stanley Parable 2. Este es un modelo súper genérico, además, el de Stanley, ¿eh? A ver, hemos visto el botón. Vamos a ver, es que son las 7, también debería dejar de jugar. Free new easy achievement. I can't believe that simple. It just works. ¿Qué decía? ¿Es un, es un logro súper fácil. Lo consigues. Pull the lever, recibir a new achievement, no more steps. It just works. Get yours right now. Now, here's something special. You remember that broken test achievement that got left in the game on accident? Well, I'm developing a technology to simply give you the achievement. Yes. You see, you'll come to this lever, and when you pull it, the achievement will be given to you. It's as simple as that. ¿Por qué es tan complejo? Okay, perhaps I should have clarified. This is technology that will exist. Right no. Now, the achievement is still fully broken. I'm not a wizard, Stanley, but I guarantee it will be fixed in the sequel to at last satisfy the hordes of ravenous fans all over the world who have been uproariously demanding this feature. Gamers, we hear you, and I promise it will happen. No, mi logro. <laughs> Qué mierda. Más es una zona super cutre. What else? What other exhibits haven't we seen yet? Hostia, pero que me quedan cero ya. You know what? Let's bring the jump circle back for Stanley Parable 2 as well. It's a Oh wait. You already spent all your jumps the first time we saw the jump circle. Hmm. Oh well. I suppose it can just be a nice decorative piece then. Puta mierda, en serio. No me lo puedes devolver. He gastado todos los saltos para todas las partidas. Me he condenado. <laughs> Jump circle, this map. Free achievement. The button is the name of the player. Spain the game. Merch. Setting world champion. Stanley para versión de bucket. Office decoration. Epilogue collecting. Infinite hall. Exit. Hostia, que, que hay un mapa de verdad, loco. Hostia, por ahí hay algo tremendo. ¿Qué hay? La K. Infinite Hall. 
Porque esto es enorme, tú. ¿Y aquí? Salida. Uy, no, no, no. Puedes encontrarles. Collect them all. Can you find them? You can find them. Ah, collectibles. Ah. Now it's a real video game. In the Stanley Parable 2, you'll run around gathering up these miniature Stanley figurines. And what's truly innovative is that there will be no reward for collecting all of them. I don't want to stifle the intrinsic joy of watching a number go up. You simply collect all of them and then you move the hell on with your unremarkable life. Ah, son figuritas de Stanley. Hostia, chaval, qué ominoso. Madre de amor hermoso. No me puto jodas. God, it really is the worst when you collect everything in a video game and then they give you a big fancy reward for it. Absolutely tragic. ¿Y cómo salidas, chungas? Okay, I'll be honest, I haven't yet decided on this one. I think that in the new version, the office could use a bit of decoration, like balloons. But I'm undecided on get well someday and happy 12th birthday. Which would you go with? Happy 12th birthday step niece? Esto no es como prima segunda? No, nieta se eh, nieta o sea, de, de madre madrastra. Abuelastra no existe. Y. hostia. Eh. Get well someday. Me gusta más. You know, sometimes when you solicit another person's opinion, it makes you realize that you knew which one you actually really wanted all along. Happy 12th birthday, step niece, it is. La madre que me puto parió. Or actually, maybe I should have gone with... No. No, I've made my decision. We're moving on. Come now. You've already made your choice. It's true that you chose badly. But we all have to move on from our mistakes. <laughs> no, por favor. Esto me está matando. ¿Esto qué es? A common complaint of the Stanley Parable was that it was confusing and paradoxical that it engendered a chaotic sense of reckless despair in those who played it. Well, I am happy to say that after much consideration, I've engineered a clever solution to this fundamental problem with the game. It's the Stanley Parable Reassurance Bucket. You see, Stanley, anytime you're holding the bucket, a sense of calm and ease will fill your mind and your heart. It's true. As long as you hold onto the bucket, the many disorienting contradictions of the Stanley Parable will feel perfectly normal and perhaps even comforting. You may even come to long for the gentle embrace of jarring cognitive dissonance while the bucket is in your arms. And to be honest, it's a much more convenient solution for me than actually redesigning the game to be less uncomfortable. Can you imagine what a pain in the ass that would be? Yes, the bucket is the perfect solution. Come on, give it a try. <laughs> Can you feel it? The glow of comfort, even in the face of crushing despair, must already be sweeping through your body. And in fact, can I say that I do believe the bucket lends you an air of charisma as well? I think that just holding it has made you the slightest bit more attractive as a person. The benefits of the bucket seem to go on and on, don't they? All this and more await you in the Stanley Parable too. Me queda el cubo. Does anyone give out awards for most enjoyable bucket in a video game? That really should be an award if it isn't already. Me falta el Infinite Hall, ¿no? El agujero infinito. Este es el, ese es el cubo. Ah, no, esos son los globos. Me falta el epílogo. 
Hostia. Tiempo, profundidad. Tiempo, profundidad. Distant past, distant space time, futuro de ti. Hostia, ¿y esta movida? Opening, rim, depth, infinite, surrounding area. Hall entrance, infinite. More hall, 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 hall. Depth, space, science, more. Hostia puta. It just keeps going. Aquí hay un agujero infinito. Stanley, here's an idea that I'm truly fond of. It's never been done before in a video game. This is in fact a hole that you can fall down forever. That's right. Infinite falling. You can fall until the end of time if you like. A stunning leap forward for video games as a medium. Wonderful. One of my more ingenious concoctions, if I do say so. Now then, since you've gotten to see the infinite hole, you can press the teleport button to pop back up to the top, and we can continue onward. Hmm. Now, I don't mean to be a bummer, but I do recommend you use the teleport button to go back to the top. Maybe do it on the sooner rather than later spectrum of things. Okay, Stanley. I don't know quite how to say this tactfully, but it's possible that I slightly exaggerated the infinite nature of the hole. Ah. Is it a very, very deep hole? To be certain it is. It's an extremely deep hole. I don't want anyone to say that it isn't an astonishingly deep hole. It is. Is it infinite? Well, that sort of depends on your definition of infinity. From one perspective, the infinite is merely philosophical in nature. It's more of a... Okay, well, good for you. You found the bottom of the hole. You found me out, Stanley. I'm a liar and it's New man. so clever. Look, I think the issue here is just that you're unusually fascinated by falling. What normal person actually wants to fall infinitely? I figured the hole was as deep as anyone would actually need. Don't you put this on me. Maybe you're the problem. <sighs> Look, uh, things got a little heated there. I think we both said some things we didn't mean. Why don't we just put all this behind us and agree to just call the whole mostly infinite? If that works for you, then go ahead and press the teleport button to warp up to the top of the hole and we can move on. I'll just be up here when you're ready. Great. Now, I'm very excited to show you. Oh, for heaven. You see, I was right. The problem is you. The problem is that you like holes too much. Not normal. A normal person would have said, yep, that's an infinite hole right there. Goes on forever till the end of time. Don't need to see it all, but not you. Oh, no, 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 no. You have a weird sort of... Oh. Did the hole seem even shorter? Es más corto. I couldn't help but feel like you spent a little less time in there than you did before. I mean, admittedly, I didn't make an infinite hole. I didn't think it was that not infinite. Well, I suppose once again there's nothing to do here. If you decide you've had enough of the hole, you can hit the teleport button and come join me up above. Had enough? I'm positively thrilled. Gosh, how could I have guessed? You're back in the hole. If this starts to become a thing where... Wow. Okay. Yes. I'm starting to become extremely certain that the hole is not only not infinite, but that it's growing steadily less and less infinite. Le error online no está desenviame, sí, ya termino. Where it's no longer feasible. No voy a contraprogramar a mí mismo, no sé, idiota. Even by the lax overall standards for accountability and marketing. What's going on here? Stanley, I have no explanation of the uncertain nature of the hole's length. Here, let's try something. Let's pop back up to the top and we'll see if it gets any shorter. Well, there it is. Hostia! My lie has come to haunt. How is this still appealing to you? I know you're obsessed with... Acá no puedo saltar. this depth, I just can't see this scratching the itch. Oh, who am I to judge? You just do whatever it is you're here to do and hit the teleport button when you're ready to move on. Hmm. 
Is the um, uh -huh. teleport button not working? You sure? Well, I mean, I really don't have an explanation. It was working just a moment ago. Try it again. Still nothing? Well, I suppose... I, I suppose there is one thing I can do to fix this. I'm out. Goodbye, Stanley. What? I couldn't bear to be away from the hole, and now you'll get more time with it than you could ever have asked for. It's a win for everyone. You get to be with the hole, I get to do literally anything else. No. Take care, Stanley. Estoy atrapado. You in the hole. Have a wonderful rest of it. A medio milímetro, a medio metro de profundidad. No. Socorro. No, esto es horrible. Esta sensación es monstruosa. Hola. You're awake. It seems you had sort of dozed off there, drifting away into dreamland. But we can't have that, Stanley, because this hole is just so darn fascinating that I want you to be wide awake for every second of it. You don't want to miss a single moment. So how about if I just pop in from time to time and wake you up to keep you really, truly focused on the hole? From the looks of things, you and I will have many, many years here in this hole. And I'm looking forward to all of them. Stay alert, Stanley. I'll be back. Toodle pip. Me ha volado la cabeza, eh. Ah, se acabó. Here we are. Go on, try out some of the new features. Vale. Eh, otro día sigo. Otro día seguimos mirando movidas. Vamos de raid con Levi Roll. Vale. Ah, vamos con ellos y ya está. ¡Hala! Eh, otro día sigo. <ríe> Joder, qué triste mandar una raid de un espectador, pero bueno, lo que hay. ¡Hala! Nos vamos. Adiós.
Ay, espera, soy idiota. No, no, no puedo hacer raid en mi propio canal. Ah, no, sí. Así que puedo, sí, vale. Porque este es el chat de Levia Games. Vale, vale, vale. Brice ido ya. Me he quedado solo. Como con el cubo. En fin. La vida es dura. Adiós.